How's it going? How you doing? Holy crap, you are a different person than yep. I was just Yeah, there's two of us here. So my partner explained why he pulled you over, right? Yes. And then we had someone call in about your driving behavior. They said maybe you were kind of like driving in between lanes, weren't really staying no, in your I lane. Just, I just, I literally was in my own lane. I have to go to my place right here. You have to go where? To my place right here. Okay. I, I was not out of pocket. Okay. Yeah. Um, where are you coming from? I flew in from Wisconsin. From Wisconsin? Yeah, I had to do something in Green Bay. You had what? I had to do something in Green Bay. Okay. Green Bay, Wisconsin. So you're just coming from the airport now? Yes. And then just trying to go, you're staying over here? Literally, yes, ma'am. Okay. That's great. Okay. Um, any, like, alcohol tonight? I mean, I drink on the flight and... That's it, I guess. Would you know what time that was at? No. No? What time did you land? I don't know that either. You don't know what time your plane landed? No. Okay. Um, how long is that flight, do you know? From, so, from Green Bay to Minneapolis was 45 minutes. From Minneapolis to here was three and a half hours. Three and a half hours, okay. And only one drink? Yeah. What did you have? At the, well, on the plane, on the flight, before they closed it off. Like, and what kind of alcohol did you have? Oh, uh, tequila. Tequila, okay. Was it like a single shot, double shot? Single. Single? Yeah. Okay, all right, just stand by with me real quick and we'll be right back with you, okay? okay. So you have to get out of the vehicle when we tell you to, okay? It's case law, Pennsylvania versus NIMS. Go ahead and stand back here. And then we're going to walk this way. We'll step over here. So just because you said that you had some alcohol tonight, in your driving behavior, I just want to make sure that you're safe to drive, okay? Wait, well, no, I I didn't do anything bad driving. Uh, I, had a, I had drinks at the airport, but I live right there. Right, I understand that. Mm -hmm. But my partner pulled you over for a traffic violation. Yeah, we had did. someone who called in saying that your traffic wasn't all that great. We didn't see that, so we didn't witness that. But we just had someone call in. My partner here did witness you make a traffic violation. Okay. Yeah, I did do a tr I, I okay. turn. I did a U-turn thing. And you told to me that you had here. some alcohol, yes, which sir. I just want to check that you're safe to drive. If you had one shot on a flight, however many From hours ago, then you should be good to drive, and there shouldn't be any concerns. Yes, I don't. I don't have any concerns. I just got to go over there. Okay, I get that, but I'm I'll not worried about that right now. Want me to. Okay, I'm not worried about that right now. Okay. 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 Uh, Okay, so do you know what the legal limit is in the state of Arizona? Yeah, I already had a DUI bad. When did you have a DUI? Uh, 2019, 2020. Oh, okay. sorry, so 2021. What's the legal limit then? Oh, I have no idea. No? I did a class in A point zero eight. So yeah, what do you think you're at right now? I don't know. I think I'm trying to go... Because you told me you only had one shot, and I know you only didn't yes, have one I shot. I was drinking on a flight. I was in first place. I was drinking on a flight. Okay, but I asked how many drinks you had on that flight, and you said one. You said you had one shot of tequila. Just keep your hands out of your pockets for me. Oh, sorry. I, it, it's just my cell phone charger. Okay, I'm sorry. that's fine. Sorry, sorry. Oh. Okay, so you're at a point three two five right now. Okay. So you're under arrest for DUI.
1910-1990. We're walking to the second car back here. What, what am I supposed to do about my car? So your car's gonna be towed. You're gonna get all the information with you about it. So what I'm gonna have you do is just face this 911 for me, and then just face spread your feet. Just face. Yep, spread your feet. I'm gonna put gloves on. Okay. But I'm literally right, but I literally live right there. Do you have anything on you that's gonna stick me, poke me, hurt me? No, just my cell phone. I have to call my girlfriend. She okay. Me. Yep. When we get down to the jail, I'll let you call her, okay? Do you have any bags on you? I don't have any. It's all in that car. What do you need out of the car? I just need to park it right around the corner. Well, we're not going to do that. Down. I'll still sit down. Nope, we can't do that. Well, I gotta make sure. Okay, I'm just letting you know right now if I missed anything during my search, any weapons, contraband like that if you bring it into the jail it is a class two felony so did i miss anything i'm not worried about that i don't have anything on okay me. i just want he's to good just... watch your step is there is there anyone like i prom i won't do anything can i just like sit down on regular like honestly it's too like i'll just sit down i won't do anything what are you talking about? Your cuffs? Yeah. So it, I can fit it's very like four fingers in there. these. It's not meant to be comfortable to sit back here. All right, which is why I'm never back here until y'all did it. But just I'll just sit back here and I'll go to the station. I'm gonna call my girlfriend when she give me my uh, permission. Here, I'll do this for you. I'll move your cuffs to the front. Okay. Is yeah, that okay? Yeah, All yes, right. Yes, go yes, ahead and step out. That's okay. Is that better? Yes, ma'am. All right, hey, perfect. Hey, hey, hey. Can I, can I please uh, call my girlfriend? So when we get to the jail, I'll let you call her, okay? You'll go in a phone room and can talk to her privately. She's at work. I'm kind of stuck. Wait, I don't want my car to get towed. It has to be. It. No. No, it has to be towed. Watch your knee. Oh, 